Hey, welcome back. I am Elato1316. Special agent in charge of bugger all. And today we're continuing with Sonic 3 and Knuckles. This time Angel Island's own Act 2. With the score tally there. And something I forgot to mention in the last video, because I just got it at the end, is the bubble shield, the third shield. Gives you a little bounce, it's kind of fun to play with. A little higher than your regular jump, nothing you can't do with the lightning shield. It also lets you breathe underwater, so that's pretty cool. And we'll... what? Ah. Sometimes that doesn't break, there's a rock wall there, it's supposed to break when you spin into it. Every now and then it doesn't, but you can go back, like we'll do here. I want to go behind that rock wall because it's usually the hardest to avoid. It's a special stage. Here we are, the second special stage, and uh, let me just... Okay, that's just me showing off because I'm a jackass. Uh, we'll continue on. You obviously don't have to do anything backwards. Not yet, anyway. I don't really have a lot to say in special stages. I'll put a plug in. I like Christopher Brown 1988's LP. He just has amazing charisma and crap, and a British accent, and British people are cool. I like British accents, I don't know why. And you could have spoken like this, that's the tragedy. And all you had to do, all you had to do, was just not throw our fucking tea into I Boston Harbor. Oh yeah, go left at that first fork there that I took. If you want the perfect anyway, you can go any direction you want if don't care about the perfect, and then go straight here at this second fork. Easiest route if you want the perfect. And, uh, something I didn't mention last time. The, uh, special stage speeds up as you go. You may have noticed. It's a bit nerve-wracking. Especially bits like this, when there's bumpers there, you might roll right back into a red sphere if you're going too fast. Because, yeah, a red sphere sends you out of the special stage. I don't think I mentioned that. But, uh, yeah. Red sphere means you're out of here. So, you know, and yeah. You want to save these for last, and my route does that, because you don't want your last spheres to be spheres that are going to turn into rings, because then they'll turn and you don't have time to collect them, because you're getting the emerald. And we got the emerald, our second emerald. And another long score tally screen. Good times, right? I love the long score tally. Managed to squeeze two one ups out of that. Not bad. So many lives. How many lives do I have? There's our continue man. We'll continue through the zone. I have ten lives in the second act of the first zone. Sonic 1, you'd be lucky to get ten lives in the whole freaking game. Let's go down here. Oh, I hate these little caterpillar. I can't time them right. There we go. But I wanted to come down here because there's another secret. You're thinking, where's it at? Hang on. There we go, platforms! Up, up. That's the flower. Extra life! Those flowers seem to be guarding extra lives a lot. This is the upper path. We don't want to take the upper path, it's boring. Ah. If I can do this. Ah! There we go. Lower path. I don't want to take it because there's another exciting thing here. Another one up. Generous with the lives here in Sonic 3 and Knuckles. I don't think even when I was a child I had to use continues in this game because there's just so many lives. Let's see. Oh, I can't quite make that jump, but I've got a bubble shield! Ha! And of course, the lightning shield can do that too, and look, a lightning shield. Continue right along. Watch him. Supposed to swing across those, but I got a lightning shield, I do whatever I want. A button. What did the button do? We'll find out in a minute. Let's go up here. What's up here? Oh. Oh. Didn't really mean to bounce onto that. This is a Tails route, or if you can have Tails carry you. Which, yeah, that's the only time Tails is really useful, is if you have another player playing him. Or an Xbox controller. Go watch Cybershell's videos. Uh, let's continue through the level. Star post. Oh, this. This bit. If you happen to fall through, there's a lightning shield over here, just so you know, and you can jump right back up and clear the thing. So if you have trouble with that, now you know how to get past it. The flower pot. 
And if you continue along that lower path there, where the lightning shield was, there is a 1-up, but uh, I think we'll be alright, because look, a 1-up. So yeah, you can get a 1-up going that way, or you can get a 1-up going this way. Doesn't really matter. We'll continue along. Yeah, we'll show or tell all the secrets I know about, and speaking of, there's a... If I can get down there, there's a secret down here. I'm gonna try to do this without losing my lightning shield. If you touch the water with a lightning shield, you lose it. Let's just... You go to hell! You okay, go to hell then. and you die! That's never happened to me before. I've never been killed by the appearing platforms. Let's get our, uh... Lightning shield. And try this again. Well, no, let's not try that again. Let's just continue past that area. Because we don't really need to. Can't believe it. What a shameful death. But yeah, if you touch the water with a lightning or fire shield, you lose it. The water shield's the only shield that can go underwater. And I was trying to clear that freaking water over there. But, uh, got crushed. Learn something new every day, right? And yeah, we're just not even going to go down there this time. Lightning shield, phones everything, jumps over everything. Lightning shield for the win. And yeah, jump there if you want to keep your lightning shield, because we're all right into that bubble shield. But there are rings in there, they're worth having. You need a power ring. Rings are always worth having, pretty much. I don't know, not really. They're points at the end. And you know, other than that, you don't really need more than one ring at any given time. Oh, coming up little cinematic scene. It was kind of cool as a kid. It just kind of annoys me now. Uh, it's kind of cool for Tails abusers, I guess. I'm just gonna close my eyes, hold right, and take a nap. I'll set an alarm. There's my alarm already. Look, it's Robotnik. What a shock. And yeah. He uh, blows up this bridge, just so you know. If you stand on that bridge, you're probably gonna die. You can flame dash him though. Wouldn't recommend flame dashing later because he might bounce too far back. And yeah, flame shield, your shield choice here because he shoots fireballs at you. Shield of choice, you're looking to make the boss work on your terms, basically. Rather than having to work on his. And that's it. We thrashed him. Yay. Just pop a little canister here. And look at that. Sonic got through Act 2. And I reckon we'll go ahead and cut it here. Poll for this video. How many lives do you think I'm going to have by the end of this? Because, like I said, really generous with one-ups in here. Uh, the winner will get a metaphorical cookie and a mention in the last video because I don't really have anything cool. Alright, I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.